Hey everyone, so today I have another um, contest entry. I know I do a lot of these, um, but you know, giveaways are something that I like to do and it's a good way to get makeup. Um, I think they're fun and it's fun to like work up your energy like, am I gonna win, am I gonna win? And then you get let down. But then sometimes you win. And I've won one giveaway, but that's not the point. Actually, I won a giveaway from Frankly Scarlet Faced, which is I'm entering another one of her giveaways. And I compl I didn't know I didn't enter this giveaway until like five minutes ago because I have another giveaway, uh, another entry up on um, October Favorites for Lucy's Makeup Tutorials. And I didn't, I thought that I had one up for this one too because it's like it's the same I have to show my favorites in this one too so I was like freaking out and I looked at my phone and I was like whew it's not November November's not over yet and I was like whew whew okay so yes this is a contest entry for frankly scarlet face October no October favorites giveaway but um this is just my favorites in general not necessarily October favorites um so yeah I recently just won her past giveaway for the second prize so some of those um, goodies that she sent me are also in these favorites because how could I not like love them? Okay, so first off is the Vegan Palette by Urban Decay. And although I just got it today, I love it. Um, I literally just got this in the mail. But it has Sin, um, this is half, no, Smog, Twice baked. No, that's not sin. I'm so sorry. That's half baked. Gunmetal herb mix. Nix mix. And I'm wearing this on my lid right now. You see it? Uh, I hate when girls do that. Uh. Um. So yeah, that's definitely a favorite of mine, and as well as the 24/7 and zero. So I'm really liking that. Like super, and I love the packaging. That's so cute. Okay. Another thing that was from, um, frankly, Scarlet Faced was this blush by e.l.f. And this is in Fuchsia, no, Fuchsia Fusion. And I have it on right now, right on top of um, Blush Baby. But it's more bubblegum than this. But I really, really like it. So definitely, definitely a favorite. Okay, and then I have a bronzer from the to the Beach Collection by MAC. And this is in Lush Light Bronze. And I like this to just wash my face out with bronze. Um, not with an actual kabuki brush or like a big brush, but I take a fan brush and I just wipe it on there and just dust it on my face to give it that really nice bronzy glow because this is like really pigmented. Like it's like if I did this all over my face, I'd be a, uh, I'd be tan, like fake. <laughs> Jan. Okay. Um, next, I have this on my lips right now. It's Pink Fade by MAC. And I wrote this in the comments for the comment entry. And it's so pretty. It's a lip gloss. And the, I have this all in a cup because I'm in my mom's room. I have all my favorites in a cup. And then I have this um, Girl Attic Beauty Face Glimmer. And I, like, honestly love this. I like putting it right here because I don't like, like, um, like, as a highlight, I don't like doing light stuff. But I like doing shimmer stuff, and this is really pretty. Like, if it's like that, and when you blend it, it's just so pretty. Like, can't you just see that gold, like, sitting right there? Like, especially if you have, like, a bronzy eye. Can you, like, imagine that? It's so pretty. I really highly recommend this stuff. This is in 14K. I believe it's like $18, though. Um, so, yeah. Like, look. Yeah. Okay. And then for NYX, I have this um, eyeliner. And I love this eyeliner. It's in extreme gold because it's just so pretty it's just so pretty it's right there and it's so pretty I just love it I do okay and the next is my only MAC lipstick 
which this will be forever my favorites. Um, probably until I get a new one though. But this is in pink plaid. And it looks more Barbie pink on camera, but it's really, really, a really nice color. And this is a matte. And then I have my Girl Attic Concealer. And this is the best concealer I've ever, ever used. I've only used three concealers, but this is the best one so far. And it's, it's kind of like the e.l.f. one, but more of a creamy, thicker, um, more coverage consistency. And that's what it looks like. It's very medium coverage, which is what I need. I don't need I don't need light coverage because my chemo makes me really um, dark circles and really dark around my mouth. Um, but I don't want heavy coverage that it looks like I'm wearing concealer. I'm only 12. Um, but anyway, I really like that. And then it also uh, another thing that you got me, which um, I actually my friend wore this today. And it was really pretty. And this is the Extreme Wear um, Cream Eyeshadow and Eyeliner. We use this as a base. And it's really pretty. It's by Ulta. And it looks like that. I just totally put it on top of the shimmer. But it's still really pretty. And it's like a baby pink. And if you're wondering, it's in VIP pink. So if you want to go get that, you should. Go get you some. It's what a lovely, the gorgeous look. And then a pigment, sorry, it's a lot. I'm gonna end it in four minutes because we're almost, well, I'm almost out of time. And then a pigment that I love is Tan by MAC. And it's just a shimmery light color. It kinda reminds me of Sin. Like right there. Yeah, that was an awkward place to put a swatch. Okay, and then second to last thing is this Sally Hansen um, Pink Slip Nail Polish. It's a really, really, really super light pink, almost white, but it's so pretty if you just want a really, really super nude pink. If you do like three coats of this, it's so opaque. It's like so gorgeous. I really, really love that for like um, just uh, light pink nails, you know. Okay, and then a brush that I've always loved, and um, it's pretty. Uh, it's my only MAC brush that I purchased myself, is my MAC 219, and I just washed it, and what I do when I wash my brushes, I put floss over them, like I wrap floss around them, so they don't go fringing out, because like when I do that, when they're wet, they still fringe out, so that's why it's so domed right now. But I just love it, and I like them domed better like this, even though it's for blending just because I can get more over the crease and stuff. So, that was my um, favorites, just in general. Definitely, there are some um, November favorites, because um, we're in the month of November now. Um, and yeah, so I can't wait to see who wins, and good luck to everyone, and go into the contest. Um, thanks guys, bye.